My name is Dustin Ogsit and I'm a project manager here at Aquila Commercial. Today we're going to go over the five things that may typically affect the overall budget on your office build out. Those are condition of space, size of space, quality of finishes, office layout, and project schedule. So when it comes to building out your space, one of the first things you'll notice is the space could be in second generation or could be in shell condition. When it's in second generation, basically the office has been built out before. You normally see some cost savings or a reduction in cost if you're able to find a space that's in second generation and you're able to kind of use it and tweak it to fit the way your use could be. So shell space is basically a blank canvas. I mean, it has not been previously built out before. Um, there's no existing infrastructure. So you're going to have to build every wall. You're going to have to install every finish. You're going to have to install all the mechanical, electrical, and plumbing to support your office layout. So shell cost, you know, always is going to be at the higher end of your budget if you're targeting a space that, that hasn't been built out before versus second generation space where there could be some aspects of the space that can be reutilized and reused. So the second thing that you're going to be focused on when it comes to what affects your overall project budget when building out your space is going to be the size. Just makes sense the way you say it. The more you build out, the more you're going to spend. So when building out a larger space versus a smaller space, typically the economy of scale will work in your favor. The square foot dollar amount uh, is typically a little bit lower or lower than a smaller space. Third thing that's going to affect your office build-out cost can be the quality of finishes or the quality of construction. You know, examples of this might be the level of light fixture you may select. Uh, similar with carpet, there's multiple manufacturers who make carpet. There's, there's also a different type of product that they provide. Broad loom carpet versus carpet tile. Almost everything that you're going to be putting in your space is going to have those various price points, you know, high, medium, low. And depending on how you want your office to look, the feel you want, you're going to be able to kind of uh, find that range. There might be a need in some instances uh, to have higher end finishes, or you may not. So the fourth thing that could affect the overall uh, budget of your project is going to be the layout. How dense of a space do you need it to be? How many hard wall offices do you need to construct? Is your company one of those that Everybody needs to be in an office or can they be in an open area? Are you one of those tenants that needs multiple conference rooms or do you just need breakout areas within the space? The fifth thing when it comes to what will affect your overall project build out is going to be the project schedule. The schedule is one of the most important things that I always focus on besides budget and quality. It's going to save you money if you have the appropriate amount of time to to design the project, bid the project, get permits in hand, and then end up building it. If you're rushed at, at all in that, needing to fast track the project, typically you're gonna be spending more money because if you can give the, the design team and the project manager enough time to take your project from inception to completion, um, you're gonna be saving the most money possible. So again, when you're looking at your overall project budget, there are multiple things that could affect it. We kind of went through the five major things uh, today. Those are the condition of the space, the overall size of your project, the quality of the finishes, your layout and any specific amenities that might be included in that, as well as your project schedule. So for more information, go ahead and check out the full article on our blog. And remember, nobody knows Austin better than Aquila. Patrick Morrison here from Aquila Commercial and we hope you enjoyed that video. Click here to subscribe because we are coming out with videos weekly. Click up here to watch another great commercial real estate video and click that like button if you enjoyed the video you just watched. And if you want to just sit here and stare at me, well, good job. You're doing it.